Hi everyone, I'm just going to give you a bit of a, an overview of the conditioning that we did yesterday. So if you missed it, um, I'm going to show you what all the exercises that we did were. If you want to um, do them in your own time today, you can do. The format we usually do for conditioning is to barter. So 20 seconds work, 10 seconds rest. We do each individual exercise four times and then you have a 30 second rest between each of the different exercises. So I'll go through the exercises with you now and I'll also put with the video what they are in order. So I'll show you what they are and then you can reference when you're going to go through your list and do them yourself. So for this workout you will need a weight. I'm going to use a backpack because um, it's something that everyone should have available and um, you basically put things in your backpack to make it heavier. So I've got a couple of bottles of shampoo and I've put a couple of, um, of dumbbells in there as well just to make it a bit heavier. Um, if you've got, or your mum and dad have got one of these which is a kettlebell you can use this as well. Um, so all the exercises that we're going to do are adapted kettlebell moves that you can do with a backpack. So the first exercise is a goblet squat. So you go, hold your bag in front of you, legs nice and wide. And we're going to do this for 20 seconds. So the whole point of using the bag is that if the bag gets too heavy, you take the weight out. If it's not hard enough, you add more weight. So that's exercise number one. Exercise number two is a single arm raise. So you're going to hold the loop at the top of your bag or hold onto your weight. You're going to bring it straight up in front of you, like this. And the whole point is to do it nice and controlled. We're not just swinging it, we're bringing it up nice and slowly. So on the side, you can see it like this. Bringing it up. Nice and slowly. So you're going to do that on the right arm. And then you're going to do exactly the same thing on the left arm. So four times on the right, four times on the left. So that is our one arm stuff. And then we're going to do... Um, a burpee and we're going to lift our backpack up at the end um, in something that's called a deadlift. So as you can kind of see, I'm going to hold my backpack in the loop, I'm going to put it down in front of me, I'm going to do my burpee, all the way down to the floor, jump up, grab my backpack, I'm going to stand up nice and tall and then back down and repeat. So burpee, down, back up, grab my bag, up and down. So that's 20 seconds on that, four times over. 10 seconds rest in between. Um, exercise number five. I'm gonna hold my bag up here. I'm basically just gonna lift it over my head, so keep my elbows in nice and tight and do something called an overhead press. Keep squeezing. Simple. So that was exercise number five. Number six and number seven. We're gonna put our backpack on and we're gonna do some reverse lunges. On the right leg first, so just on the right leg, keep using the same leg. So do that four times and then on the left leg. And when I say four times, I mean four rounds of 20 seconds. Perfect. So those were exercises six and seven. Number eight. So we're going to bring the backpack above our head this time. I'm going to switch arms. So I'm going to grab it by its loop, I'm going to bend, I'm going to bring it all up to the top. Switch. So a nice squat, bring it up nice and quickly. So that was the exercise number eight. Uh, exercise number nine on the floor, this is the bridge thrust. So let me move this so you can see. So I'm sat on the floor, put the bag on my tummy, feels nice and flat, and I'm going to lift. And the extra weight should make that a bit more tricky. So you really squeeze. Try and get your bum as high as you can. And then exercise number 10, I'm going to go into a plank. It's called a plank pull through. So I start the bag on one side of my plank, up into my plank position, and I'm just going to pull like that. It's hard if you're not on a slippy surface like that. You really drag it while staying in that plank position. So I'll put all the instructions with this video, but now you can see what each of the exercises are. Uh, let me know if you manage to complete it as well, and then you can go back and do it a couple of times over the week if you want.